Success means different things to different people. For some, success might be financial achievements, becoming a millionaire, for example. For some, it might mean accolades. For sportsmen, it may mean trophies, championships, or medals. For some, being successful might simply mean achieving a state of wellness, health, or happiness. Whatever it means to you, take note of these 10 habits of all successful people. They apply to any area and any meaning of success. Number one, they set goals. You've probably never met a successful person who doesn't set goals. Because the chances of you finding what you want without a clear target to move forward are right around zero. If you don't know where you're going, you will end up someplace you didn't plan to be. Setting goals should be the number one priority for anyone seeking success. Define exactly what it is you want, your end goal. Break down exactly what is required to get there. Mini goals. Make sure your why, your reason for doing what you must do is strong. So when you hit those roadblocks, when things go wrong as they always do, you have the strength and purpose to keep going. Number two, they take responsibility for their life. Another key attribute of all successful people is they take complete responsibility for the success and the failures in their life. Unlike the majority, they never play the victim role. If something doesn't work out, they don't blame others. They learn the lesson. Learn one more way not to do something and move on quickly. Your energy is always best spent in the present and planning for the future. Your thought process should always be, how can I make this work? And what can I learn from this? Never living in the past or making excuses as to why you aren't where you should be. Remember, everyone suffers setbacks. Everyone has the opportunity to either blame others in circumstances or to focus on moving on and creating a better future. Regardless of what has happened, you decide what you do now. Number three, they have great self-discipline. Discipline is a strong trait of all successful people and it is one that can be developed with consistent use. Anyone that works from home or unsupervised knows the importance of self-discipline. When you are alone, will you choose to go through social media, watch cat videos on YouTube, or do something that will be beneficial for your future? It is much easier to have discipline if you have clear goals and a meaningful purpose, something that is much more important than meaningless distractions. Number four, they are obsessed with self-development. You can't really claim to be successful if you have given up working on yourself. This doesn't mean you are never satisfied, just that you know it is human nature to want to grow and learn new things. Be open to learn new things and develop your mind through mentors, audiobooks, and reading. The more you learn, the more you will earn, financially and spiritually. Number five, they read a lot. Reading is a common pastime of many highly successful people. The majority these days can't sit alone for two minutes without becoming bored, picking up their phone to go on social media, probably to post about how bored they are. Successful people, however, are almost always happy to be alone. To be alone in quiet. To have the opportunity to read or listen to something that will benefit their mind and their future. If you're not a reader, try audiobooks. You can play them in your car, in the gym, or while you shower. And use time that might normally be wasted to gain new skills, new strengths. Number six. 
They manage their time well. Time management is essential to success. Unsuccessful people usually get stressed and overwhelmed when there are too many tasks on their to-do list. Successful people are rarely phased. They prioritize the big payoff and most rewarding tasks first and leave the insignificant ones to last. Knowing it matters most to do the most valuable tasks first. Successful people plan in advance, days, weeks, months ahead, knowing clearly what needs to be done to complete their jobs and reach their goals. Number seven, they take risks. If you don't buy a ticket, you can't win the raffle. If you don't take big risks, you can't achieve big rewards. Successful people know that there will be times they will need to take risks in order to get where they need to go. Often, most people won't take those same risks for fear of failure. However, the greater failure to successful people would be that of regret. Risk going for the life you want or guarantee living with one you don't want. Number eight, they keep going when they suffer failure and setbacks. We all suffer setbacks. Every single person that attempts to live their dream life will suffer through failure. Many of them might even lose everything. Most quit. The successful never quit. They keep going, knowing their greatest character is formed in adversity, knowing their success story is being written in every moment. And it will be especially good now they have a comeback story. Number nine, they find a way to win. Successful people find a way, period. Whatever life throws their way, they deal with it, dodge it, smash through it. Whatever is required, they find a way to win. It's the whatever it takes mentality. It's the confidence in knowing whatever happens, I will give my all and leave nothing on the table. I will find a way to win. Number 10, they do what they love. If you're not doing what you love, you can't really claim yourself a success. Spending the majority of your working hours, also known as the majority of your life, doing things you hate for money is not successful living. It's torture to the soul. If you need to suffer doing something you don't like to get to a life you love, do that. But do not lose sight of exactly that. Your ultimate purpose. Find your life purpose. Think of all the things you love to do more than anything in the world. Then brainstorm how you can turn those passions into profit. Doing what you love every day. Even if you were taking a pay cut, it will be worth it. Do what you love every day. And you will never work a day in your life.